Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Two years ago I beat Forest Frontiers with just 4 tiles and I predicted that it was impossible to beat any scenario with fewer than 4 tiles. I was wrong, as today I will show you how I managed to beat Bumbly Bazaar with just 2 tiles. The goal of this scenario is to earn 1000 euros in one month from shops and stalls. This seems like quite a lot, but we can use an exploit to beat this with really few guests. If you price your umbrellas at the maximum of 20 euros, no one will buy it because it's too expensive. However, once it starts raining, the price doesn't matter and every guest in your park will buy an umbrella as soon as they can. With a profit of 18 euros per umbrella, we only need 56 guests to complete the goal. In Bumbly Bazaar, you start with a few guests, some stalls and some path connecting the two entrances. This is obviously much more than two tiles, so we sell all the stalls, close the park, wait until all the guests have left and then remove the path. Now we have a blank slate with an entrance on both sides of the park. The setup is really simple. Build one piece of path with an information kiosk next to one of the entrances and some sort of food or drink stall on top of the path or the info kiosk. Since this method of beating this scenario is quite unreliable, it is a good idea to save the game now and make a backup in case it doesn't work. Rain is rather rare in this scenario and we need to make sure that when it does rain we have enough people in the park to get the 1000 euros we need by selling umbrellas. The easiest way to do this is to run both available ads all the time and hope that it rains before your money runs out. This is where the food or drinks stall comes in, as without it we would only be able to run one ad, which does not get you enough guests. Trapping guests with a no entry sign does not work, as guests that want to go home will not buy an umbrella, even if it rains. With the setup complete, we now wait until it starts raining. The only thing that we have to do is renew the ads whenever they run out. If we max out the loan, we have enough money to keep the ads going for over 3 years, which is usually long enough to get rain at least once. If we're unlucky and we don't get rain within that time, we simply reload the backup and try again. And that's it, we have just beaten Bumbly Bazaar by using only 2 tiles. I will once again say that I do not think that it is possible to beat this record. This is because you need at least one tile of path to get guests into your park and another tile to have something on for the guests to interact with. This can only really be a shop as any ride requires at least 3 tiles. Feel free to prove me wrong though. I'd like to thank BR Weather for inspiring this video. If you liked this video consider giving it a like or leave a comment. You can also subscribe or follow me on Twitch. Thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next video.